joining me for my thankful vlogmas now I did a little Black Friday shopping online of course and amazingly I pretty much shopped small everything I purchased on Black Friday was through online small businesses which is kind of cool I haven't done that before yeah did a lot of online Black Friday shopping and I also went to the mall today just to get the kids out of the house and to just kind of get out a bit because we haven't really gone out. So right after breakfast, I stopped off at a store called JQ Store Hawaii. And it's right next door actually to Eggs and Things, which is where we had breakfast. And usually when we go to Eggs and Things, it's a little earlier in the morning. So the kids always look in the store when we left Eggs and Things, they were actually open. So by the time I got out of the restaurant, they were already in there. And so we looked around and um, of course there was a lot of like figures, Japanese import figures and stuff like that, but they're kind of an expensive store in my opinion. So I don't really buy anything in there, but they do have a nice stationery section. And pen section. And sticker section. I was kind of browsing that area and they actually had a Black Friday deal still yet or those like Fukubukuro blind bags. And so I picked up this bag here. And now this bag says it's a hundred dollars of mostly pens for $50 okay so and they were having a 10% off deal if you spent $100 so I bought <laughs> I really shouldn't have but I did so we're gonna be opening this up to see what is came in these bags and the thing that I'm most thankful for today on this vlogmas day is my husband he is such a trooper he puts up with all my craziness all my mood swings ups and downs of emotions and also lets me buy you know turns the blind eye lets me buy things that i want but <laughs> but he also is good with the kids of course he watches them when, and lets me kind of browse around and he's also a youtuber so he does his videos at night when the kids are going to sleep when i'm putting them to sleep and you know, he works really hard, his job, and also is a YouTuber, so. And he allows me to do the things I want to do to fulfill my needs and wants and wishes, and I love him for that, and I'm so grateful for him. Now back to this unboxing. I'm gonna put, point you down here. So we're gonna open up this bag, see what my husband turned a blind eye towards and let me buy today. <laughs> right now. Okay, so this is the blind bag I picked up today from JQ Hawaii. So. It's a $100 value of mostly pens, and it costs $50 for this bag. And it seems pretty hefty. I'm not sure what's in here, but we'll take a look. So we'll open the first one here. Okay, I'm not going to look. Okay, so we got a Sarasa Clip Zebra Pen. Okay. Oh, what is this? It's a little eraser, a pilot eraser. Oh, this is one of those erasers like for those erasable pens so it's not really an eraser it's just like a plastic tip here and you can erase on your papers with that oh that's pretty neat okay so there's a pen eraser there and oh okay we got an ink refill for a signal uni ball pen cool oh okay so this is just a body of a pen Okay, which brand is this? This is a three color holder. This is the kind where you can just put whatever color you want inside the body of the pen. Let's hope that there's some pen inks here. Oh, I have this actually. The Kita Rich, uh, this is a glitter highlighter pen. Okay, this is gonna be a really long video if I test every single one. So I'm gonna start pulling out. <clears throat> so we got a Mickey Mouse eraser here. This is a Pilot a a Arc Acroball 07. I'm guessing this is just a black. Oh no, this is a red color. Okay, it's really nice. We got this uh, Friction Ball 07. And looks like it's an erasable um, pen. Oh, look, okay, what is this? This is the Style Fit Signal Uni Ball. I think this is a pen refill. Okay, and then we got it in a green and a blue color. And then we got this Sarasa Zebra um, 04 in this gray color. 
Okay. Uh, another handful. There's quite a bit in this bag. I'm pretty surprised. Whoa. Okay. So here's another um, refill, pen refill for the uni, uh, uni ball signal. Okay. Then we have oh, another friction ball pen in 05 in this dark blue. Ooh. Okay. Another friction ball pen in 05 millimeter in this bright blue. Ooh, I actually have this pen. The Black Uniball Signal Pen. This is a fine point here. This is a good pen. And this is a pink highlighter. The Friction Pilot Highlighter. I believe this is erasable because it has this eraser tip at the back. And this, okay. <laughs> what is this? It's a $15 pen body. Which I know these pen bodies can be quite expensive. Uh, here, maybe not so much in Japan, but I'm not sure who this guy is. <laughs> maybe I'm too old to know what that guy is. Oh, but it actually comes with the um, the pen, the pen ink in there, so that's good. Here again. Oh, a lot of pen refills. Okay, so we got the um, the refills for that pen body here. I guess we can just stick those in there later on. Oh yes, my favorite. This is the uh, Furinosuke Pilot Pen. Is this the Pilot one? Yeah, the Pilot one. Love this. Here is another um, three ink one in the 05. This is the Uniball Jetstream 2-in-1. Wow, there are a lot of pens in here. And this is the Pentel B100. Oh, this is an interesting looking tip. Look at that. Can you see that? I'm not sure what is this a brown ink? Let's see. Nope, it's a blue ink. But wow, that tip is so interesting. It's a really fine ballpoint. The tip almost looks brown. Huh. Okay. And then we have the Rushan Petite Water Base Pen. Oh, so it's like a little a little felt tip pen. That's kind of cool. And then we got, oh, Daisy Duck, and I guess it's like a two-colored ballpoint pen, and the bowl comes down here too. Okay, these are the last few pieces in this bag. Okay, the Sakura Decoris pen. Oh, this pen is like four dollars at their store. Oh, okay, so this is like a ballpoint pen. I've never seen this pen before. Oh, it's like a, oh, it's a little dry. There we go. It's a pretty pink color, like a gel, milky gel pen in this pink color here. Then we got the Drift LT. This is a mechanical pencil. And this is the 005 size. Wow, this is kind of a nice pencil. I like the tip here, how it points like that. Huh, okay. And then we got another uh, dual t uh, ink pen. Acro Ball in 05 in red and gray ink. And this one is the Energel 07 Ball Metal Point Pen in the color red. Okay, so that was bag number one. So there. Now, hopefully, we don't get too many duplicates here because these are a lot of pens, especially ballpoint pens. <laughs> So I was hoping for more felt tip or art type color pens, but I guess, you know, being that they're a stationary store, they have a lot of ballpoints, so we shall see what we get in this one. I'm gonna pull out a bunch of stuff. Oh, there's a lot in this bag. Okay. All right. Oh, look, oh, I hope they're not duplicates. I think this might be a duplicate. Oh, I hope it's not exactly the same. That would suck. Yep, these look pretty much the same. <laughs> Great. So we got duplicates. They, they said not everything was the same, but... Uh, oh, well. That was fun, though. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm kind of disappointed. As you can tell, I've torn my clothes. I actually don't mind having duplicates of this one because I really like this pen, so... Okay, so we got a duplicate of everything. I picked so well that I picked the same bag. <laughs> so
so here are the pens that I got from this unboxing of my blind bag, literally blind bag, from JP Hawaii store. The, the pen refills are good though because, you know, you can always use a pen refill and they do dry out, so it's good to have them on hand. And I've never tried some of these pens before, so maybe if I enjoy these pens, I can get other colors in them. This pen looks really nice. I'm kind of anxious to try this one in my journals here. But anyway, that is my unboxing of my two blind bags from JQ Hawaii. If you stayed this far into the video, thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for joining me on my evening art break. I hope you enjoyed watching me unopen up these two blind bags from JQ Hawaii. And if you enjoyed this content, please put a little star emoji so I know that to do more videos like this as well. And also please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and hit the like button if you like this content. And also make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you want to see more videos from me. And with that said, you know what to do. Just keep drawing. As you can see, I will be doing a lot of drawing. <laughs> and this art break is done. Bye guys!